Welcome to URL Battle Rap Arena with Street Star Noah, Set by Psycho, Jesse Rick here. What's good, guys? Yeah, what up, man? What up, Norbs? What's the mother I just said? I had your mother inside of my lap. Um, what's up, guys? Uh, we're back. The first episode of January, I mean, uh, 2013, January 1st, 2013. It's going to be interesting. New year, new everything. Same old retarded Jesse. Um, I got a battle on Sunday. Oh, word, word. Shout out to Jesse Retard. He has a battle. 40 Ounce Jess makes his debut against a guy that I don't know his name. I think his name is Omni Boom or something like that. Adi Boom? Something like that. Something like that. So he's battling uh, Adi Boom on Sunday at the main event at um, Bloody Knuckles Battle. So if anybody's trying to go... Um, Definitely, I'll be in the building. I'm actually going to host the massacre, so I'll be there. <laughs> um, you know, right after I watch some of the playoff games, I'll, I'll go right to to, to make sure that, that Jesse doesn't die too bad on Sunday. Um, <laughs> I mean, Jeff, I mean, I don't know. Are, are you ready? Next? Uh, usually you'll call niggas and be like, yo, you got to hear my bars. I'm retarded and stuff like that. Nah, nah, but, nah. Uh, I, I don't want to spit you on my bars this time, but I, I have it written and I'm ready. Trust me, I'm ready. You're ready. So, so you're going to perform it out. I mean, what can we expect? Can we expect um, Chilla JC or can we expect a uh, something something a lot less than that? You know what I mean? I mean, has Rex been giving you uh, lessons? I don't, I, nah, nah, I don't want to compare it to nobody. But no, nobody's helped me. This is all me, good or bad. Like, this is all me. I expect a good show. That's all. Well, my you know, question to you is this: uh, uh, Is, is the dot mob going to be behind you? Because I know you were kicked out of the dot mob, and um, <laughs> you know it, it really struck you. You know what I mean? And I expect Adi Boom to come at you about that: the fact that you want to have sex with T Rex. Um, hmm. I, I, are you prepared for all that? They're gonna, he's going to come in. He's going to go on and he call you a retard, and and um, basically, I, I know what he's going to say against me already. I already know what he's going to say against me. So, so you got to you got to plan out. I mean, you got a solid one round, unlimited round. Um, you're really no, it's four minutes. Four minutes. Oh, okay. One one round, four minutes. I mean, is forty ounce just going to? Sh- I mean, how? I mean, are you going to dress like a normal human being, or are you going to be the same Jesse we see at the battle? A forty ounce Jess. Forty ounce Jess is going to make his battle rap debut. He's going to do his thing. So you're, you're basically going to look like a wino. I got you. <laughs> I mean, I'm excited for the battle, man. I mean, I spoke to Beasley actually earlier today, and um, mm-hmm. he's actually like, man, that's going to be crazy. So Beasley actually might come through. Um, Smack actually, he might not come through, but his beard actually will come through. <laughs> so it's going to be kind of weird, but, you know. But I, I'm, I'm excited just to your debut. You know what I mean? Um I mean, tell, tell us how do you how do you feel of what, what the fans got to expect if they show up tonight, if they show up on Sunday. And let, let them know the information right there, by the way. I'm excited, man. You're going you're gonna to see a good show, man. And plus, we we have other people on the on the card, too, that that are pretty good rappers. So, I mean, we're, we're going to do it up. Norbs is hosting it. So, I, four, four minutes. If you want to come support me, come support me. If you want to come hate on me, come hate on me. But... I mean, uh, I'm, I'm going to be there to hate on you as well as for you. So I'll be the first person to tell you you got killed when you walk out of that ring, but I'm also going to be the first person to tell you, man, you're my brother. So it's nothing. But I'm, I'm, I'm excited for that battle, man. I'm definitely excited for that battle. And to start up the year, I think it's a good battle. Same way the young of JC battle just dropped uh, about four minutes ago. Um, so whoever's out there that's not listening to the show, fuck you. Go watch Young Young and JC. 
Um, or you can just pause it and watch it after the show. But okay, I know you guys are going to listen to it, so it's probably just going to be me, Jesse, and Sacrifice, and, and Big T. And, um, <laughs> you know, Big T and uh, Mickey Fax are going at it. They definitely going at it recently. Um, about the time Big T gets back in the ring, I mean, that's my boy. Um, I mean, I don't know. I mean, Jesse, uh, I know you got some things you want to talk about. Yeah, I, well, uh, First, with the big T, Mickey Fax, I got big T two to one on that one. And maybe 3 0, but we'll, we'll see what happens. But other than that, I mean, Skills does a yearly wrap up. Uh, he mentions you're going to get this work. Like, what, what do you think about it? Were you surprised when you heard that line? No, because I, I mean, no disrespect to Skills. Like, I think, um, you know. It's a it's a dope honor, you know what I mean, to be mentioned that and it was one of the biggest things that happened in hip hop in terms of what Lux did against um his calico and, and a lot of the phrases that were that are still being used today, let me you know, um, he didn't get this work and and all that type of shit. But um I, I was actually more shocked when Drake did it, to be honest with you. You know what I mean? Like that was kinda like, Oh, that was, that was crazy. But um, I actually do listen to Skills on um, recaps every year or whatever you want to call them. I didn't get to catch this one, but shout out to Skills man for 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 repping um, you know, uh, Lux and, and what 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 you know, what he did for the URL. So you know that was dope. That was definitely dope. I know you were mentioning too uh, uh something else about I don't know what the hell you were talking about, but you could you could tell. Uh, Soldier Soldier Boy and a Little Scrappy went back and forth on each other on Twitter. The soldier boy said, "You ain't gonna put your paws on nobody. Don't make me tell them about the time me and Gucci was in the club and you got punt. Let's go to war. I fucked your girlfriend. You're a bitch." Um, little, this this is soldier boy to little scrappy, and little scrappy replied, "Let's go, um, soldier bitch. You got money but no heart. I'm ready. I know you a gay pussy nigga." I knew you took pipes, it's all around, and you're going to lay on top of a nigga. I'm going to see you soon. So, I, I, mean, I mean, like, what do you think about this? Like, the beef for hip Is it good for hip-hop or is it bad? I mean, I honestly think that they give people way too much of a voice on Twitter. And, and, and my thing is, like, if you find somebody on Twitter, and no disrespect to Scrap or Soldier, but I don't know the niggas personally. But I think you, you're retarded. And I'm going to tell you why. Because if, if something were to happen to either one of those guys, who do you think is going to be the suspect? You know what I mean? Really? Like, what are we doing? I mean, is it really that serious? I don't, I don't like the whole Twitter beef. I get people threatening to slap me all the time on Twitter, and I just kind of laugh it off. Because at the end of the day, you cannot catch a case over with all you all, you cannot get slapped over Twitter, but you will catch a case over that motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. You can catch a case on Twitter. So if you're actually saying what you're going to do to somebody or whatever, that's fine. Mm-hmm. But I, I just think it's stupid. I think they, um, if they are going to, you know, I don't know how, like I said, I'm not, I'm not in the middle of that beef. So all I can say really is that, if y'all could just battle it out, let's do it on the URL. That's what I said. Let's do it on you all up. That is out. Like I said, if you want to put it on Twitter, obviously you want to showcase it. So why don't you showcase it in what you guys do well in this rap? And and then nobody has to, you know, fucking get hurt or whatever. Just just go at it. And then after that, if you guys can't settle it, then, you know, we'll settle in the ring. Who knows? Let, let them scrap. Like, I, just, I just think it's stupid. I think it's extra. I think um, Soldier Boy and, and him are, are, are artists that they should definitely carry themselves a little more professionally, in my personal opinion. But, um, you know, I, don't know. I personally don't care about that, to be honest with you. you know, I don't know. What, what do you think, Jesse? Um, I, I want to see them on the URL stage. I mean, I wanna, I'm waiting for that mainstream two artists. It looks like it might be Cassidy and Meek. I'm not sure. But I want to see two mainstream artists on that URL stage. I mean, I'm saying Soldier Boy would be the I, I kind of want to see Soldier Boy in Bow Wow, though. I kind of want to see that before that. You know what I mean? I don't know. I, I kind of want to see that. 
I want to see Jesse's mom versus the ring card girl from last time on Madness. <laughs> I don't. I really don't know who's hot because if you guys don't know, Jesse's mom is actually really hot. Like if your fans don't know, she kind of looks like um. You ever seen Rush Hour Two? Or was it Rush Hour One? I don't remember. The uh, the Spanish girl. Oh my God! What what what's her name? Um, uh, Psycho. You probably know. Don't give me a line. I don't remember off the top of my head. He was in the game plan with Rock. I totally forgot what name is, but that's exactly what Jesse's mom looks like. So we don't know why Jesse came out looking retarded, but his mother's absolutely beautiful. <laughs> but um, Jesse, where the fuck is this guy? I, I can almost guess where. He's no, no, I'm gonna get him now. If you wanna go, if you wanna go to a caller real quick, I'm I mean, let's get a few right callers. I mean, like I said, while people watch yeah. the battle, he's probably at Harold right now. To be honest with you, but um, you know, whatever. Let's get to let's get to a call. Let's get to some callers, Ross. Like, oh. Uh, four one four one four. You there? Oh, yeah, I'm man. Walking. What up? Walking. That's it. That's it. My place to leave. My my second place of place to go to. What up? I got a question What's for you. When did that battle with Jesse Rican? When when that buzz be going down? That battle with Jesse Rican? It's going down this Sunday in the city. Actually, this Sunday. In Chicago? No, no, no. That's in New York. New York. But I'll be okay, in Milwaukee yeah, January. I'll be in Milwaukee January twenty for the bars and brawl steps battle. Yeah, We're doing the. Uh, it's the ladies battle. It's gonna be some really lovely ladies battling that night. And you don't know what street is it on? Like what club? I really don't know all the info, but you can follow. Um, you can follow me on Twitter, and I will definitely be tweeting it out real soon. But I'll be out there for that. Okay, um, well, who's uh, who battling this Sunday? Then Jesse Rican versus who? He's battling. Uh, I, I keep forgetting the guy. Adi Boom. His name is Adi Boom. He's battling on Adi Boom this Sunday. And um, I think What's Jesse's going to get killed in that battle. Who else on the card? <laughs> yeah, Jesse, he's going to kill you. Unless he gives him a like, uh, Only way Jesse is going to win unless he gives him a couple of 40 ounces to drink, then he's going to win his bar. I, I, have no, I have no clue how Jesse's going in that battle. Like, I, I don't think it can happen. If he can't, if he can't, if he can win, if he get a dude, if he get his, if he get his opponent drunk, then he can win. <laughs> if Adi Boom wins or loses, whatever, if Adi Boom loses, he can never battle up again. No, when Jesse, anybody, anybody loses, anybody loses to Jesse, they cannot rap anymore. <laughs> I gotta, hey, I want, I want to bet, uh, North. If, if Jesse Rickin wins, you can't uh, talk about him no more. You got to be his friend for the rest of the year. The rest of the time, I am you can't. I'm just no, you can't talk about him. You can't talk about him. You can't talk about him no more. No more talk about him on URL. You can't talk about him no more. Well, yeah, that, that, that'll that'll be tough week. because then, then how can we, you know, how can we continue to have a show without making fun of Jesse? You, know, you, can go at Psycho. you can go as Psycho. You can go. You can go as Psycho now. Uh, <laughs> it's, not, it's not as much fun. Psycho's my man. I, I can't go as Psycho. You know what I mean? Psycho's we my guy. Somebody. Well, who else on the ring on the card this Sunday? Ah, uh, no fucking. It's not my card. So I couldn't even tell you, bro. Jesse, do you know? I'm just there. I'm, I'm like, Jesse, do you know who on the card? No, I don't think Jesse's here right now. Jesse, we lost Jesse. Jesse trying to come back on now. Well, he but he up there banging that forty to the head. Why he listening <laughs> to that song? <laughs> take, take it to he listening to that song. Take it to the head. Why he banging that forty? <laughs> well, I will Marvin? see you. Uh, you said January twentieth, North. Yeah, I'll be out there during the twentieth, man. So we definitely gotta get up. The lovely ladies are gonna be. Are gonna hey, be uh, uh, I tweeted you already. My name is Shatown Warren. On, uh, on, uh, cause I'm, uh, it's Shatown Warren on Twitter. Okay, okay. Hit me in. Are you doing better right now? No, I've been tweeted you. That's uh, I'm gonna have to go back to it. No, uh, up in the uh, hold on. Let me do it right now on the phone, too. But it's three star north, right? Yes, sir. With no S at the end. No S at the end. Okay. But I think you're on here and I tweeted you. I, I, I actually wrote you before, too. Oh, okay, okay. You got to just find me because I wrote you and asked you about when y'all dropping. A long time ago, I asked you when y'all dropping that young EO and uh, Cortez battle. And you said something about you don't know. So the what, what battle? Young EO conceded? Yeah. Well, I'm going to take the rest know. of Chicago battles. Yeah, he said young EO Cortez. Oh, you know, you know, that's never going to drop. I actually took the footage and I took a shit on it and then I threw it on the block. I never want to see that battle ever in my life, to be honest with you. Oh, okay. Okay, okay yeah, but I'm going to, uh, 
just look, be looking for the tweet, uh, Shatown Warren. All right, boss. Thank you. Thank you for calling. Let's get to the next caller. All right. Okay. Um, Psycho, I never want to see that battle. I swear to God, I, I, I hated that battle. Yeah, I, I didn't hear anything good about it. I wasn't there that day, but, yeah, I, I, you, I didn't hear You didn't miss anything. It was bad. It was bad for business. <laughs> I'd rather uh, watch Jesse rap for about an hour. <laughs> Six one nine, you there? Yeah, I'm right here. Yeah, we're good. What's up, boss man? Yo, what up, Norris? This is Tim from uh, Battle Rapper, man. What's up, man? How you doing? Pretty good, pretty good, man. So I wanted to kind of touch on. Um, you guys were talking about, you know, mainstream artists and kind of the look that it gives. I mean, I guess I have a kind of good and bad feeling about it. You know, I, I don't know that. What's up? How do you know I'm listening to me? Yeah, I wanted to. I, I was thinking, like, you know, with these artists kind of going back and forth and just kind of playing with it, not really jumping into the ring. I think it might have as, as good of a look as it has. I think it kind of, on the flip side, could kind of have a negative look as far as you know. Well, these guys are never going to battle, so. You, you know, do you kind of get what I'm saying? Kind of like with Meek and Cassidy kind of jumping back and forth, back and forth, and the uh, Soldier Boy coming back and forth, back and forth. You know, as much as I would like to see that mainstream battle happen, you know, I keep thinking, like, you know, maybe it's just all for the records. And, and you know, when when their fans start seeing that it's just like, all right, man, well, these guys are just beefing just to, you know, jump their record sales. You know, Meek just doing it to sell his records. You know, why are we going to take this seriously when we don't think it will ever happen? I mean, um, I'll be honest, I think we're becoming our own industry, and yeah. we're the front runners in the industry, and I think, I think Meek Mills, and I think a lot of these other artists are seeing that, and I think it's going to be a way to make revenue for them as well as promo for them, because yeah. the battle community is a growing community every day, and I, I mean, what, what more promo, you know I mean, like that, even when cannabis battled, um, um, I don't know, it wasn't a real battle, but the promo actually helped, um, you know, build up Cannabis' album, although his album was yeah. fucking terrible. I think it's a way that it can, it can market your album as well. And, Do you and think that like, with as much as Meek, though, has to lose now, that he's willing to take that risk? Just because, like you said, the culture is so big, like, what if he just tanks? Do you know what I'm saying? And, I mean, this is like, you know, you, you got to, like, this a microscope that's on you. When you accept that battle and you're getting paid whatever it's going to be, say a hundred grand to battle, and you lose, and you're Meek Mill, you know, you're signed MMG, you have this whole team to back up, and you have that much confidence to go in, you're dropping disc records, and you get slayed in that ring. I mean, that's a lot mm -hmm. to lose. So you're saying basically that it will, it will hurt sales, album sales? I mean, I feel where you're coming from. But at the same time, like, if your music is good, I believe yeah. that it'll, it'll, it'll move regardless. You know what I mean? And yeah. I, I actually like the point you bring up. That was actually a really good argument. Um, I mean, if you die in that ring, you die in that ring, man. And it's true. It, can't hurt you. it definitely can't hurt you, and I agree yeah. with you. But at the same time, if, if, if you do bring it, you just introduce yourself to a lot more fans. And yeah. I think the hype on the album, I think a lot of people will benefit from that. Yeah, um, yeah I agree. And, I mean, at the end of the day, like, we're all here to, to expand and, and, and take this culture to a different level. I just kind of don't want to see it get saturated with something where it's only for, you know, like, their, their, you know, because it's such the raw form of hip-hop. It's, it's, it's just battle rapping, you know what I mean? It's well, nothing I, I like. Totally agree with you. I totally it's agree not. With you it's it's completely different from a diss song, you know, talking about money and 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 women and shit, shit like that. Like it's so different. Yeah, I mean, I remember hearing like ninety five or or even more like ninety five percent of artists that are out now could not come back and battle in that ring and do no, what I these totally guys agree. do. I totally agree. So and you know just, what? Like battling now is so much. So different now. And, yeah, and, I agree. And, like, these guys were battling on the street corners and, and Meek Mill battling over here. I think they take that for granted and, yeah. and 
Valley in front of 4,000 people's acapella is a lot different than Valley in front of your neighborhood or your friends. And, like, you know, especially when you, I'm going to keep it on, you all it, it's a totally different, different like, these fans are fucking ruthless. I'm not even going to sit here and lie yeah, to you. I agree. And, um, I mean, even though these guys have performed, like, I think they, they think they're performing in front of thousands. Mm-hmm. Like, they're like, yo, I can perform in front of a few thousand. Why can't I battle? Your performing yeah. record most likely that people know. So people are excited once they hear the record. When you yeah. perform a cappella, these people don't know what the hell you're going to say. Yeah. You know what I mean? They're not going to a beach. you got to literally entertain people for about 20 minutes. It's yeah. tough. You know, yeah. I'm not saying that these guys don't have the ability, because obviously they can rap. Yeah. But it's a different element. And I, I definitely think them not accepting these battles is due to the fact that they actually do respect the sport. Because they don't yeah. want to make ass out of themselves. And yeah. um, the ones that do want to do it, I respect it too because they are definitely, um, you know, respecting that this is an actual sport, an actual thing that they can benefit from. So, you know, everything that is pros in its time, I would love to see Cassidy versus, um, you know, Meek Mills and URL. I'd like to see Common versus Drake. I'd like to see uh, Soldier Boy versus... Uh, um, uh, uh, Bow Wow. Soldier Boy what? and Bow Wow? Yeah. I, you know what? I want to see it. You know what? These guys are going back and forth for so long. You know how much yeah. dirt they probably have on each other? I think most yeah. of it is going to be like a fucking soap opera watching Soulja I Boy talking about how. You know, okay, he, okay. He, it's, and that, that's really it. You know what I mean? I, yeah. I want to see them be like, ooh, I want to be wild by their lyrics. But all the dirt that they're going to say, like, yeah, Bow Wow probably fucked this guy, this girl, I'm mean, so probably with this guy's girl. Or, I kind of want to see that. I want to see all that. You know, I mean, it's interesting. As a general, yeah. I think it makes a good battle. No, I'd rather see Big K. I'd rather see Loaded Lux. I'd rather see Calico battle. But it would be, uh, it would be interesting to see these guys actually battle. You know what I mean? Yeah. I so. so I mean, I I know you're not into. I, I don't know if you do predictions. I'm sure you don't. But I mean. With with Cassidy and Meek Mill, if they came back, who do you think would have the edge up as far as coming back? Do you think that's what? Um, not not who's gonna Cassidy, win, but has the edge up I mean, coming back. I think Cassidy's more of your your prototypical battler. I think she'll have the advantage. Um, I think Meek Mill's one thing Meek Mill will definitely have is the real nigga talk. Meek Mill's yeah. I've been up fully. I've, I've actually got the kicking with Meek Mill's. And I and I know what they what them boys are about, and yeah. they some real you know what I mean he's gonna have that real talk shit, and he's gonna have a shock factor in terms of him saying things to, to, to Cassidy that Cassidy can't really rebuttal, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? And I think it would be real personal. I think literally, I think Cassidy would probably bar for bar win the battle, but I think Meek Mills would pull some shit out that will really shock the crowd, you know what yeah. I mean? And, and I think, I think it, 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 that can actually have the making of a classic. So that one I would like to see. Because like I said, I know, like I'm always in Philly. I know, you know, you hear the stories, you hear the rumors, you hear this, you hear that. I know a lot of it, you know what I mean? So a lot of that stuff hitting the mainstream or whatever will be kind of dope. Oh, yeah. But, um, you know, we you have know? to you know, but I appreciate the call, man. We got we to gotta get to the next uh, call. Yep. Yeah, yeah, hold on. You? Yeah, we're going to get on. Jesse, you back? Yeah, I'm back with the guest of the hour, Big T. He didn't pick up at first. So don't blame me, blame Big T. Go ahead. I know, I know. You? I Big, T, Big, T, Big T got a bone to pick with me. I know. I mean, like, he attacked me on Twitter <laughs> recently. Um, he asked me if I was making jokes on him. And Big T, I was making jokes. But, um, you know, you my nigga. So, you know, you know how that goes. Right. What's the deal? What's up, Big T? Man, what's the deal? Hey, Lewis, can, can I ask you a question? Yeah, Big T, your phone's out of shit, by the way. Yeah, man. Your phone's out of shit. Hey, can I ask you a you question? Have... Do you hear me now? Yeah. Yeah, I hear you now. Okay, can I ask you a question, Norm? It's a serious question. You can ask me whatever you want, brother. All right. Everything you just said. Why haven't you told Mickey none of this? What do you mean? 
about the guys trying to jump back in the ring that they think that they can do this. You haven't told Mickey Facts none of this. Whoa, like, you know what I'm saying? That's your boy. You're supposed to tell your boys the truth. It's a okay. difference between you battling on a playground corner and you coming into the URL and battling professionally. All right, we know you watch a lot of NBA games. Does that mean you can play in the NBA? I tell you, I tell I would actually tell Mickey that, and I actually told uh, Jesse that. But I do think that he has the ability to battle. Having said that, you are definitely the favorite walking into this battle. And 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 I honestly say, like I told everybody else, I think that um, taking somebody of your caliber right off the bat is usually a mistake. And um, it's a bad mistake. It's it's it's, it's like. Come on, man! You you going against a seasoned dude? And well, how does how does this? I'm tired. All right, I'm tired of battling new old people. What I mean by that is these guys that haven't proved nothing, and then they just jump into the ring just because they did something off the camera or what? I don't know. I've never seen it before. So who's to say he did it? You know what I'm saying? Who's to say he killed? So oh, let me ask If that's how you feel, right? This is the question. Why do you accept this battle? Well, so it's a lot of it's a it's a lot of political reasons. Okay. So that I accept this battle. You know what I'm saying? I I, I kind of want to embarrass him in front of his own people. I mean, he's been talking a lot of smack. I mean, he got on the show last time. And, and I want and I want to battle him. I want to battle him in like the blog sites that love him. I want I want to kill him in front of them. I want, I want them. I want everybody to witness the massacre in front of them. You know what I'm saying? That's it. It's no other. It's no other way. It's it's, a, it's publicity. I'm I'm gonna murder Mickey Fax. It's, it's no way around it. You know what I'm saying? Like you feel like not a chance. I don't see. Like I don't see it. I don't see it. And then against me? Come on, man. I, I remember with the best of them. I remember with the best of them. Boy. You put y'all y'all bringing this to me now, and first of all, another reason is y'all know why it, it, my the window looking short, man. There ain't too many more people for me to battle. It's a lot of people, and with that being said, I'm try, I'm on my own. Um, I'm 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 starting the Chicago URL shit with um I talked to Beasley or whatever. You no, know, I ain't talked to my man Norbs yet, but you know we gonna have Norbs out here, man. You know most Chicago niggas need to be on the battle scene, bro. I know y'all feel the same way. Now, now, let me ask you a question. You just said something very interesting. You said there's not a lot of you run out of people to battle, which I disagree with you, and I respectfully disagree with you because I feel like there's always somebody that could come up. You've seen your real battle, JC. You've seen Matt battle, Calico. You've seen um. Uh, what else? I, I mean, there's a couple I of names. What? What'd you I say? Said you say seen Matt battle, Calico. You've seen uh -huh. JC battle, Young Ill. You're probably going to see DNA versus Chilla Jones very soon. You might see B. Nazareth conceded. There are a lot of new talented guys that are coming oh, yeah, up, and it yeah, might yeah, actually yeah. be a bigger... I was, going, I was going to also say, like, them, them people are not far-fetched no more. I was, willing, I was willing to take one of those guys to a point. And I almost got to a point where me and Beasley would sit on the phone for like 20 minutes, like, okay, who? And we thinking, you know what I'm saying? But I'm thinking I'm 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 gonna go ahead and jump out the window and say I'm taking three to four battles this year. Three or four battles this year. Big yeah, T, you got. I don't know who's in your background, but you gotta calm them down. I can't hear shit. Yo, I'm trying to turn it down. I'm. I'm. You know, it's New Year's, man. You know, everybody loud. There's no quiet place. About to go. He was yesterday, nigga. We look at the Chicago party for real. <laughs> oh yeah, we partying for real. You know, today is dinner day, man. You know, uh, you know, I gotta eat good. I know, I know you eat good, my nigga. Trust me. Now, um, Mickey facts. I, you know, like we, you know, we was on the show, and and then, you know, he was he was going in on you. He, he really he really feels like he's gonna beat you. It's just, well, not, he, he well, Mickey you. had one point two that I want to point out. I said, um. He said, everybody's questioning me, but which which big T are we going to get? Are we going to get the one that beat Sue Surf or the one that lost to Deacon Frost? All right. Now, this is the one thing, too. 
who prepares to go on the ward, I hope that somebody not going to be their best. Hold on. Did you just say Luther Deacon yeah. Post? I, 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 yeah, that fucked me up when you said that. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Deacon Fuller. That's my man. That, that, that's my man. But I think the general consensus says that Big T won that battle. Having said that, that was actually Big T's first battle in the U.R. Actually, the first battle in U.R. history, to be honest. With you. Right. That's the first I mean, U.R. battle. Yeah, that's the first U.R. battle ever. Um... Jesse, you want to keep going with your point? Well, no. I mean, basically, I'm, I'm just asking Big T if he has a response to that. Uh, well, well, I, didn't, I didn't hear the last thing. First of all, well, first no. of all yeah, um, Jesse's an idiot because Mickey Fights just texted me and said that Jesse's a moron, that he never said he lost to Deacon Frost. <laughs> what, what, did he, what was his quote? I have no fucking clue. We're not going to have you call anybody. But anyways, when I spoke to Mickey, Mickey said he wanted to battle four people. And you happened to be one of the list because he respects you that way. Now, mm -hmm. he, he definitely respects that, you know, that you're one of the top MCs and, 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 and all that. And he said he wanted to one battle. And he wanted it to be historic because he never wanted to battle again after that. Really. Mm -hmm. which, is, which is actually a, a big compliment to you because... You know, Mickey Fax is, you know, he's signed to, I think he's signed to Sony, he's working on his album. And, and to me, it, mm -hmm. it's going to open doors for a lot of people, so I think it's dope. Mm -hmm. Having said that, Jesse's a moron. Do you think, I mean, you said you're going to clearly beat Mickey. Yeah, clearly. I mean, you, you don't think Mickey stands a chance? That's what you're telling me. No, not, not a chance. Not a chance. It just don't, it just don't make sense. It got to be like some crazy shit happened, man. He got to do some fairy dust or some crazy wild shit because it don't make sense for, you know, Mickey could rap, man. Let's just put it like that. You could rap, but it's a, it, experience going to kick in, man. Experience going to kick in. At the end of the day, Mickey going to do good, but he got to go. You, you remember, he, he got to go. He got to go the whole fight. He got to go the whole fight. Okay. My point is, if it doesn't make sense, and you feel like you're not going to gain anything from this, but that's what it seems like you're saying, then why take this battle? Why not go after Rex or, or, or someone like that? Hello. Yeah, I'm here. Big T, you there? Big T. Yeah, I think we lost Big T. I, I mean, he. I mean, I know he has bad receptions at the chicken. So, um, yeah. hopefully, he steps out of there real quick. Um, I mean, Jesse, you gotta get the quotes right, man, when you're going. But um, I, I no, I, I'm sorry if I misquoted that, but I could have sworn. Sago, didn't he say something? He said something to that. No, I don't. I never remember Mickey saying I, I that. Said, I was, Mickey said. Mickey I said that Big Force yeah. lost round three. That's what that's what Mickey said. Oh my bad, my bad, my bad. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean, it's an interesting match for me because, like I said, I I got a lot of respect for Mickey and all that. But like I said, uh, you know, he is coming back. I mean, I don't think Mickey was a prominent battle rapper. Like that wasn't his thing. His thing was music. He did battle, but you know. I don't know. I mean, do you think it's a main event, Jesse? Do you think it's a main event? Um, I I uh, definitely think it's a. I mean, I definitely think it's a main event. I, it's it's a it's a well deserved battle. I just think Big T is going to get the best of them. Really? And why do you think that? I want to hear the Jesse points. Uh, yo, you know what? I was just wa I was watching Big T versus Surf yesterday, and it's kind of like. At this point, I really do feel like Big T is close to unbeatable. This is not the Big T that faced Hollow. This is a rare Big T, you know? Do you feel like he's unbeatable? Close to unbeatable. Everybody's beatable, but close. But it's basically what you're so telling me. So what if he battled Rex? Exactly. Nah, that's what I'm got Rex. I got Rex. Of course. I mean, there's a question, Jesse. If, if Rex was playing one-on-one -on -one against Kobe in a basketball court, who would win? What <laughs> <laughs> play quarterback against uh against the um the forty nine defense? He put up forty nine probably, right? 
I can't right, hold on. I, I, I got Big T calling me on the line. I'm going to try to transfer him back in. All right. <laughs> Jesse Grady. Jesse he fucking Grady. He, he went to say we got, we, got, we, we, got to do, we got to do a show based on Jesse's obsession with T-Rex. Like, I really want to... I really got to get Dr. Goods on the show, and I got to ask him what's his diagnosis on, on Jesse because apparently Rex would never lose. Rex didn't lose anything. If oh, Rex no. jumped off the Empire State Building, he would land on his feet. No problem. <laughs> like, this guy must be made... He, he is literally the Superman of Battle Rap to Jesse. It's kind of crazy. Yeah. Is Big T back on? You know, they, they, Jesse's an idiot. Jesse's an idiot. Yeah, Jesse's an idiot. Let's do a call. Um, 713, you there? 713. Hello? Yeah. Yeah, yeah we hear you. What's going on? Yeah, um, I got a question for Dorbs. What's up, boss? Yeah, um, is it, is it true that Remedy, Remedy's on the PGs or something like that? Oh. Remedy. Um, I haven't, I haven't spoke to Remy. I spoke to Remy a long time ago. Um, we were talking about him doing one, like I said, but I know he was busy. Would I get him on the PG? I would not be upset at getting Remy over here. Um, he would just really have to reach out to me. I think Remy is definitely a good MC. When I first seen him, I wasn't too crazy about him, but I definitely see the growth in him, and um, I would definitely like to see him over here. It's really up to him. Okay. Yo. All right. Yo. Yeah. Yo, I'm back, man. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, my bad, Joe. My bad, man. So, 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 talk to me, talk to me. So, you and Mickey Fast are going back and forth a lot on Twitter. I mean, I, I hear Mickey and you. Mickey's been, he's had multiple fat jokes. Um, multiple. Probably the most I've ever seen against you, to be honest with you. Um, I mean, like I said, you came at me on Twitter the other day. It sounded like you, you felt the way, my nigga. What's up? Um, you know, this ain't my first rodeo, man. You know, these people talk fat jokes before the battle. You know, it, I, I think it's kind of corny for Mickey, myself. I, I expected more from him. He lacking class right now. So, you know, I, I expected more from that guy. Really? I mean, yeah, I, I could have been Mickey, man. He, dude, from the petty fat jokes on Twitter, the back and forth, man. You know, this is first time. This is what rookies do. That's that them rookie moves. That's what he's doing. He, he's showing me rookie mistakes. Do you think he's talking because he's nervous? What? I mean, he is talking pretty. He's yeah, pretty he's talking. the new guy. He's the new guy. No, he's the new guy. You know, he's the new guy. He think that's what you. He think that's what you're supposed to do. Um. Call him Fat Jokes over Twitter. You know, you know that that's the stuff he likes seeing because, you know, you know he's a fan of the sport. You know what I'm saying? So he's going off what he's seen other people do from the sideline. You know what I'm saying? He thinks that's what you're supposed to do. Get Big T mad. Person got me mad with Sue Surf, and and I don't think that was a good. I, you know, that was a good look for both of us. But it's best to leave me alone. That's all I say. Leave me alone, Mickey. So what you're saying is you think that, that 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 Mickey should stay in the sideline and, and play the fan role. He should just continue. Yeah, Mickey needs to just watch the battles and take the time. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't see too many people that, that, that take um referee that um take the stats of the basketball game jump in the NBA, man. That's all I'm saying. And when, you know. So, so let's, you're let's, let's, let's enjoy the sport, man. Nikki Facts, you're doing a fan You know what? Right? And another thing, you know, I was in there. I couldn't really talk. I was so everywhere. There's too much shit going on just a second ago. But to answer your question, um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to actually make it bad for, like, why Meek Mills and Cassidy shouldn't be stepping in the ring with nobody like us. Mickey is going to have to be that example. Somebody's going to have to see that no. Stay over there. You can't hang over there. All right, just because you can rap don't mean you can come play with these guys over there, man. So you're going to take Mickey and make him, and make him an example. That is your goal. Yeah. So yes. Take Mickey in that thing, 
slap him around for three rounds and basically say, you know what, Mickey, stay as a fan, go sit next to Puff. Is that what you're saying? Yes, yes Mickey, stay as a fan, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you're in, in a camera, you know what I'm saying? Get you some camera time and just watch the battles, man. Yeah. Ain't no one will watch it. Yeah, I, I've noticed Mickey has taken a lot of my camera time recently. I, he, he, you know, I, I, I got a little too Damn, Mickey. Mickey's in every battle. Mickey in more battles than me. Damn. Yo, and he'll fight you for a spot. He'll fight you if he'll fight you. I got Mickey talking to me on Facebook. Mickey talking to me on Facebook. He said, Tough, he, he's going to get his lights punched out. He's going to wow. get his feelings hurt. Okay. All right. All right. Well, this ain't my first rodeo, Mickey. Yeah, this ain't your first rodeo. This ain't your first rodeo. I'm not worried about that guy. Come on, I, I went to told the. Come on, look at, look at. You know what I'm saying? Why would I be worried about Mickey? I mean, ain't nobody, scared, ain't nobody scared to go one on one with the water boy. You know what I'm wow. saying? Wow. <laughs> don't yeah, know, ain't nobody scared to have one on one, one on one with the water boy. You know, what I mean? the, the person is taking the clock um, every time. You know what I'm saying? Bulls are the, the Knicks score two. Ain't nobody scared to play him in a one on one. Wow. So, so you call him the water boy. Of course. Why is he on the court? Wow. Why is he on the court? And you know what? I'm. This is an example because I'm. I'm going to set the example for people that think they could just jump to me. First of all, I, I got a. I got a thing for people picking me out. Like, hold on, man. Me. Your first battle, me, Big T. Do you think he's disrespecting you by calling you out? Like, I, I, like I said before. Um, I was, I was like, um, like, um, um. People might look at it as an honor. I look at it as an honor. Like, okay, Mickey, you know what I'm saying? You dope. You, you, you nice. You get busy. I want to body you, Big T. He's he been saying this shit for a while too. This ain't the first time. I might be telling about it. I'm like, okay. I'm like, my nigga. Second couple times, nigga, I'm gonna kill you one day. I'm like, all right, Mickey. I'm thinking it's still a joke. Next thing I know, I get a call. Mickey Fax want to kill you. I say, what? I'm thinking, you know, is, this nigga, is this nigga plotting against me the whole time? I mean, yeah, I, I, that, that, that's what I was questioning at next. How did this battle come about? All of a sudden, I see you guys going on. I don't know. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, man. You know, you know, I, it's a staff thing, man. It's people just get the jump line over there on the staff, man. You know what I'm saying? No, if you know, you can battle me if you want to. <laughs> Yeah, you know they say they say they hit me up like we gonna cut your check, Big T, if you don't battle Mickey. I'm like, all right, y'all, don't cut my check. All right, all right, man. I mean, who would you rather battle, me or Mickey? Honestly, <laughs> y'all both got the same threat effect. I'm gonna keep it real. <laughs> <laughs> The same, the same effect, same type of fear level comes in a play when I think about battling you. I might as well battle Jesse. Matter of fact, Jesse. Yeah. Well, you know, I think Jesse I'm battling three four times. I might as well battle Jesse. Against Ali Bull, I'm actually hosting that battle. I think Jesse's going to lose really bad. I'm going to battle on top. Yo, Big T, you're picking me on that one, right? Yeah, yeah, hell yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, man. Happy, happy New Year, everybody. Happy New Year. It's sad. It's sad that um, the see that I'm gonna have to do this to Mickey at the beginning. You know what I'm saying? In front of his peers, in front of in front of everybody that loves him, he gotta go out, man. Well, hey, you know I don't play. I don't play, man. I don't play a, a full blooded pit bull, baby. You know what I mean? If I see that nigga, I'm snapping his neck. If he's if he if he's begging for mercy by round two, I'm stumping him out by round three, breaking his neck. Wow. He's telling me stop, stop. That's a round three prediction. Big two, stop, stop. No, he wanted to, no. I'm telling y'all no. <laughs> I'm gonna look mad in his face like I, no. I did tell Mickey that I was gonna stand in his corner, but I, I'm starting to feel like if I stand in his corner, I'm gonna get a couple shots taken me. I don't know. Man, you don't want to call, you're going to get blood. Blood is going to come your way, man. You don't want to wipe off Mickey blood on you, do you? He's going to be he gonna be in the corner, damn it, can't make it to the corner no more. By the third round, people are going to be like, stop, that's enough. 
It's enough. <laughs> no, no, see, have, you, have, you, have you been have you been um preparing for him? And let me ask a question. This is a big question, actually. Due to the fact that Mickey called you out, right? He said he needed a few more and four people. Do so you think uh-huh. this whole time that he was already preparing for you as you were going through your battle? Do you think that he basically has um you know been kind of you know worked you know like uh, how do you say he's been preparing for you for a while? Do you uh, are you are you mean ambush? You think you think you think he's going to ambush? That, that's what you're saying. So many words ambush me. It could be. It could be. Mickey Fax been telling me about Battle and Mises Summer Madness too. Yeah. I'm just well, out there trying to sell my CDs. I'm out there just trying to sell my CDs, man. Trying to come up in the rap world, you know. My man Mickey Fax preparing writing rhymes for me. I was like, damn. <laughs> no, nah, but on, on some real shit, Mickey, my dude, you no know, mutual respect for my man. But it's like. Like what? What are you supposed to do? I, I don't even. I don't even like. It's no bit of. I don't know, man. This battle don't move me one way. That's why. That's why I could take three, four battles this year because the first one is Nikki. It's a warm up. Now, my question: You just oh. said it doesn't move you. Now my question is: this. Nikki Fax is an excellent rapper. Now, having said that, Big rap. Having having said that. Is it not a danger that you sleep? Is it not a possibility if you sleep there on it? Due to the fact that you, you're kind of downplaying the fact that you're like, you know what, I could take three battles and still beat Mickey. Is that, could that, could that be a mistake? Um, no. So you really don't think he has, that Mickey Fax has the skill set to give you a fight? No, man, he could rap. Nicky can rap. Can't take that away from him. But, like I said, it's a whole different ball game. You know, like like what he said, it's a difference between watching the great whites and swimming with him. He's been watching, he's been coming to watch us for years now. He think like, okay, I, I can hang. All right. Um, But let me get the biggest great white. Let me, let me get the biggest shark. Let me, let me go get one of the biggest sharks in the world. Come on, man. What you're saying is, Nicky Fax is that guy at the at the at the at halftime at the bat, at the Chicago Bulls game that gets to take a shot from half court. Is that what you're saying? Um, yeah, yeah, he 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 that guy. Yeah, but but it was but but he was he didn't get get in a competition the right way. You know, it was rigged, so he get to jump the line. So you feel like that's the only difference. He 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 didn't get his number. He didn't get his number pulled the right way. He knew somebody, and they let him take the half court shot. That's all. That's who Mickey Fax is. So basically, you're saying Mickey Fax. This is an inside job. Mickey Fax doesn't deserve the shot to battle you. And no, basically, and not alone, no. And besides, and, and because of the relationship he has with myself, Smack Beasley. And she go that we're basically skipping him over. Is that what you say? Yes, and I yes, and I think it's unfair. I do think it's unfair, and for that reason alone, I'm going to embarrass him. And then y'all are gonna see it's a bad idea. It's a bad idea. This is this is a lesson to y'all. This is a lesson to Chico, Norris, Smack, and Beasley. Quit letting these guys think that they can hang. This is a lesson yeah. to Meek Mills and Cassidy. Stay away from us. We don't play. All right? No, no. I know the fans got a bunch of questions for you, so we're going to get some fan questions right now. All right. Let's go. Uh, All right. 201. Yeah. 201. Let's go, uh, 585, you there? Hi, um, first off, uh, Norbs, uh, d- don't fire Jesse, man. I-, I like his comedy relief, man. <laughs> He's cool, man. I mean, like, he act like he don't know. I, I hope it's an act. Him saying stupid stuff, like how... It's not, it's not an act, but... It's for real? I mean, he really that naive? Damn. Oh, no, Jesse's really retarded. Like, there's no... 
There's no going around that, boss. Like, Jesse is really a fucking retard. Like, it, 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 he's in love with T-Rex. Um, it, it's, it's sad, actually. It's sad. But what's the question for Big T, boss? All right. Now, Big T, first off, I, I mean no disrespect when, when I say this, all right? I mean no disrespect. I actually like some of your battles. But but you mm-hmm. got this cockiness about you that, that I, I think is, is stopping you from actually achieving something greater. Because in, in my eyes right now, I don't think you're even close to top tier. I think you're far from it. Okay, can I ask you this? Do you think hollow mm-hmm. body do, do you think hollow body do, like, way back? I, I say I say hollow body. Yeah, see, it's, <laughs> you, so you don't think he took it three, three zip? No. Yeah, see, and it's stuff like that, man. Like, I, I, I think that's what's slowing you down. Like, I, I see a lot of battlers that come All right, in. all right, all right. Okay, okay, all right, all right. Now, what about my other battles? Like the one uh, with you against who, Surf? I think Surf got that. Okay. All right, what about Charlie Cook? Charlie got that too? Yeah, yeah. The, and right, and, and that's my... You think that you were really what about DNA? What about DNA? No, DNA got that, <laughs> definitely. I mean, I feel like I'm... All right, what about him, man? You know, I, I can't remember that battle because I... I so you said my... basically you, you, you're new. You, you're kind of new to the battle game, right? No, I've been watching... I've been watching... I've been watching, I've been watching battles since Scribble Days and Jump Off. I, I, I've been watching it for the longest time. Oh, 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 and you're oh, like a new so name. You, 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 probably, you probably wouldn't like my style anyway, then. Yeah, but the man, do you have a style? Because like like I'm I'm it's seeing all I started it. I'm sorry. It's my style I started. That the, 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 and, and people can say what they want, but all these letter rhymes that that's me. But nobody doing that before me in the battle world. Nobody. Hi. Right. But it, it's just my opinion. Who, 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 set, who, who set up? Who set up the the punchlines? The story punchlines. I I just don't have punchlines. I set up the whole story. I, I I know what you used to. When you said you with the scribble days. I appreciate you, sir. Thank you. Yeah. So, like, in, in my opinion, I, I just think that like you sound like it. Jesse too. You 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 got here with Jesse like I like the same. Like, I, 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 did, I was about to say, is you Jesse cousin? What the? <laughs> Yo, why do why do I get thrown into shit like this? No, you sound just like Jesse. I don't know who I'm talking to. Jesse, am I talking to Jesse or am I talking to this guy? <laughs> no, it's just my opinion on the whole thing. I just think that if you were a little I bit. I appreciate more, that, bro. I appreciate yeah. that, bro. Yeah. Hey, you're not you're not. Nobody's meant for everybody to like them, so I appreciate that. You know, I'm gonna yeah. work on it. Maybe next battle, you might like it. That's what's up. Probably not. Probably not. But uh, who next? <laughs> yeah, let's go to that call. Um, that was it, Jesse's twin brother right there. That was Jesse's twin brother. Man, he just sounds just like why, Jesse. I don't he's know why. Jesse. He when people get mad at just like Jesse. Like somehow I get dragged into it. Go ahead. No, Jesse, it ain't even that. I'm not, I'm not mad at the call. What's funny is he sounds like voice-wise. Like, not, not the shit that you would say, but... He sound voice wise like yo, like damn, is is this Jesse? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Uh, eight four three, you there? Yeah, I'm here. What's good? Mhm. Yeah, uh, I kind of feel like the uh, caller before, and I don't know him or Jesse, but uh, wow. not saying that you're not top tier, but uh, mhm. Uh, I don't know, man. Nikki might give you a run, man. Mm, have you seen imagine. any Mickey battles? Nah. You seen any? But I'm saying, I, was, I, was, but he gave I wasn't me too impressed with those. I wasn't too impressed with your mm-hmm. performances either, though. I said I wasn't too I impressed with your performances either. But I, but, but at least you've seen my performances. <laughs> yeah. I just won't count right. Mickey out. Uh, All right. I like All your, right. uh, Shalaka yeah. food. No, that's, that's, that's cool. And your little, you uh, seen. know your style. Yeah. All right, but have you seen Mickey's? Nah, but I'm just saying I ain't sleeping though. All I'm saying is, man, how you just know he could fight if you ain't seen him fight? Like, you know. I'm saying at least that you I, ain't, I didn't. I didn't see Lux with the new performance style battling. 
but without even without a performance, you know, it was still the same. So I heard him. But, uh, did, you see but did you see that? But you seen the Mets battle before? Yeah, and Mets it's just like right it. Mets, Mets, Mets have done it. Like we've seen it. And just like Mets, a regular, just like a regular round though. It's just like a regular so round, but just like a regular performance. All right, all right, sir. Same thing. It was it was the words that won. Ain't like oh, he did some, uh, stood in the same spot. I don't even think he moved. So as far as the performance part go, I don't know. Just listen to the words. But have you seen I'm, Nicky perform? I heard him fine. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. 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 Yeah, as long as you don't come with a, uh, I take a word like unit, and it's you and I T like, yeah, you gotta come a little harder than that. You but didn't I, like I that? Think say, nah, it wasn't. You didn't like it was that? Right. It was alright. Nah, I can't even say that was mediocre. But uh, mm-hmm. just to kind of stick to your style, uh, I guess that's what, what you. What, what, what type? What type of uh, what type of stuff you like? Oh, I just want to hear what oh. you think. I... Oh, nah, the uh, the. The Wayans brothers, the put you in the castle, living colors, that shit was stupid. Mm-hmm. I give you that. Now that was stupid, but I'm just saying. I nah, appreciate I'm it. Like, I'm just saying. Could you give me a Mickey line? <laughs> nah, not on the battle. Oh, I'm right. just saying. No, I'm just saying. No sleep. Oh, all right. I'm just saying no sleep. And yeah. I ain't never got bit by a poodle before, but I'm sure it, it, it might hurt. I'm just saying no sleep. A poodle? You can say mm-hmm. anything in your life. You make a poodle. But anyway, right. thanks a lot for calling me. Hey, hey, Big Chair, I have another question for you. And besides me, okay. a lot of people, you know, like I said, you know, you and Mickey have been going back and forth for, for like the last couple of weeks. Um, but before that, you were going back and forth very heavily with, 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 with Jesse's crush, um, T-Rex. And then, and I, like, before you were going there with Jesse's crush, yeah, that's it. Jesse's um, in love with him. It's, Jesse's in love with him. Absolutely in love with him. And, um, you know, your name came up with him. Uh, no, no, no. Like Norris wasn't here because I said Rex is the battle of the year. But go ahead. No, no, that's not, that's not what he said. He, he said a lot of things. But he also did say that Rex <laughs> would clearly beat you. What is your response to that? And uh, are you still interested in battle of Rex? Um. Uh, yeah, me, me and Rex. So I'm, I'm. Yeah, I'm still interested in battling Rex. It could go there, but you know, I'm not gonna be around. You know, making it look like how he kind of making it seem like I'm chasing. You know what I'm saying? You know, but but we but but it it's in the works, y'all. Believe me, it's, it's going down. It's reasons why Rex Rex won't just submit to it. It's reason why he didn't ex- didn't accept the battle yet. You know what I'm saying? Why, right what now? do you think those reasons are? Cause he gotta work. He gotta prepare. He can't just go in there and be like he battle Novas. I'm not Nova. I'm not G Soldier. I'm not the guy he about to battle in in North Dakota. I'm not the guy he's about to battle on. I don't know. I don't know half of the people Rex battled this year, man. Oh, you man, know, he, that's a good yeah. point, Bixie. That's a really good point because that was my argument with Jesse. Jesse was like, oh, my yeah, God, he took like, a lot of tennis games, Lord. Yeah. No, like I said, and I argued with Jesse the same thing. I was like, how many battles he had this year? He was like, man, he had like six battles. I say he battled on you. He battled, I mean, he battled on URL once, right? He battled yeah, and, Arsenal. And, 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 so he had two three-round battles. All right, like we go, we going to go with three-round battles because really this one-round shit is just some pickup game, man, shit that I don't do. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's some shit I don't do in the one-round shit right now. We got to be really, really worth it. And I tell people, if you if you going to go ahead and get one, come on with three. I do the three-round battle shit. All right, he battled yeah. G-Soldier. He battled yeah. um, some other dude, some other dude, and some other dude. <laughs> and, and it was I all one of three battles. Richie, the reason I bring that up is because I had this argument with Jesse, and he's like, oh, my God, I love Rex, Rex, get up, Rex. Oh, no, 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 Look, my, my and, whole and point on. is, it, the battle versus G-Soldier, he still spit classic bars against G-Soldier, whether it's against G-Soldier or whether it's against Big T. You can't d- take away from the round. Jesse, you said he's the battle of the year. He battled four tomato cans. 
Mm-hmm. You can never got, see the battle of the Man, he was battling on camera phones, man. I seen Rex battling on the camera phone this year. I like, man, Rex, you can really step up the camera game Jesse, on this battle, bro. Jesse, will you admit that he battled four tomato cans? But that doesn't take away. No, I don't want to call G Soldier a tomato can. But I'm going to say, I. Okay. That doesn't where take away put, from the fact that it's where, where not fine. Where would you put, where would you Lewis, put what did you call them? A tomato can? Yes, tomato can. That means basically they're, <laughs> they're not up there. They're not real names. Like, like I told Jesse, boards don't hit back. You know what I mean? Jesse don't understand. Yeah, we had a problem that happened. <coughs> basically, what I said was I said chillers the battle over here. Anything sound good. Anything sound good against G Soldier, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you probably just going off the fact that he's killing them, like. You know what I'm saying? Like, the bars is that crazy. You know, he got off. He had, like, one of this shit about the 20,000 here killing nigga for real. I think he said that. Yeah, yeah. Whoever and then, and then you got to think about it. Even some of those one rounds he was taking was kind of light. Like, he battled some nigga in A-hat, some nigga that was, some Chinese dude that was kind of getting at him. Donnie Menace. What are you talking about Donnie Menace, who a lot of people think beat him. Now, Jesse, I, I, I bring this question to you again. Who's the battle of the year? Rex. And why? Because you think he's cute or because it's that? He, yo, he was the most, look, he's the most consistent. He had, what, two, two, three classics? Jesse, how is he the most consistent, Jesse? I'm waiting. He had two, three classics where? Verb, Verb was a hot battle. The, All the right, we're going to give you Verb. No, I'm going to give you Verb, but what's the other one? Oh, wait, and the, the Young Ill battle. Those are three battles right there. That's a one round battle. It's a one round battle, Jesse. <laughs> and he a one round king. You know what? He's the one round king. Now I give him that. T Rex is the one round king. Jesse, he goes in one round. The reason you're giving him the battle of the year is because you think he's handsome. Just say that. And, and then I would be like, okay, I understand you. Chilla, I said Chilla Jones is the battle of the year because he has three classics. Possibly four if you count it. I don't like one round battles. Yeah, but how can you be the battle of the year if you choke in, during one of your battles? Jesse, how can you be a battle of the year when you battle three tomato cans? Hey, y'all see how we're going to Rex because we don't really have nothing to talk about about Mickey. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm it's, real. It's, like, it's, like, it's like, man, what do you think about that? Okay, what battle? We <laughs> that, guy was like, that, guy, that guy got on the line. I was like, man, don't sleep. Mickey, Mickey going to get you. I said, all right, what battle have you seen? No, no, but he gonna get you though. We get your ass out here, man. Let me ask you a question. Why do you think people don't give you the credit you deserve? And it's crazy man, because and, and, you know, and, and it's funny. It's funny, like no people. I, I, I just, I just sit back and people gonna like what they like, bro. They like what they like. It ain't even nothing. It's nothing to it, bro. You know what I'm saying? At first, at first, like I said, like in my last blog with Lord and them. You know what I'm saying? When we was at Rex. Like, like we, you know, where I'm from, we're not used to that. You know what I'm saying? We're not used to blogging. Like, like it, it was, it's no cameraman around. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's damn near, like, let's say nothing against, like, New York, but it's like y'all was bred for that. Like, like that's, it's, it's always been a smack DVD in New York. It's always been niggas being blocked. These niggas was blogging at 14, 15 years old. We don't do we don't do that really here. You know what I'm saying? It's a part of the game that you had that I had to adjust to. But I do kick ass. On, on play. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas know, man. Niggas know. I see. I battled. The, I battled some of the best of them, and I seen them crumble in front of me. I seen them fall. You know what I'm saying? I seen niggas lift the mail like they saw a ghost. All right, Big T. I got. I, I, Big T. This, Mickey's on cue. He wants to come on the show real quick. Um, just to uh, and, and this is this is what I've, I've, I've been through this before. It's going to be the guy coming on the show. It's not my first rodeo, man. All right, click Mickey in. Mickey line one. Uh, I'm just asking permission for I don't want you to think I'm ambushing you. That's what I'm, that's what I'm saying. Man, go ahead, man. Put Mickey on because he, he got to say something, man. Please, because uh, y'all uh, really uh, don't want to battle me. Psycho 917 number, please go on to that. Big yeah. Hi, everybody. How's everybody doing? Everybody good? Happy New Year, Mickey, man. What's Happy up? New Year. We're here Happy with me, New Year. Uh, Psycho. You know, we got the, re- the retard actually got more retarded as the New Year 
the beginning. So, yeah, <laughs> we got Mickey, we got man. He's gonna have his call, nice cocky attitude. I didn't. It's so typical, Mickey. I didn't call the I didn't call the Big T. That's the first thing. Because the you know, I called. Did you call? Did you call to question me? Because that's what you usually do. I called to, to speak to the host. How's everybody doing? So what's up? How you no, doing, Mickey? I mean, I, How you doing, buddy? What's first, your question? First, 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 okay, first thing, um, I never said that Big T lost to Deacon Frost. That's the first thing. I said that, that he, was, he that lost. Was to I clarified my bad, that. My I said, bad. I said, 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 you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And, you know, Big T, Big T is very nice. Like, he's extremely nice. And for the two callers who called in, I, I, that was actually, that actually kind of hurt my feelings because for, for them to talk disrespectfully to, to T like that was kind of crazy. I actually like the union mm-hmm. call. I thought, okay. I thought You're calling him T now. The last show you were calling Tasha. you got to keep it real now, nigga. I don't want to say I'm not, But I'm not talking to him. I'm talking to y'all. I'm not well, I apologize. Him. So you got to, you know, what I'm saying. First of all, first of all, he didn't create Letter Force. Niggas okay. been doing Letter Wait. Force in battles for years, decades actually. Okay. You know what I'm saying? That's the first thing, and it's on cam. It's got one of him. Niggas like I niggas created like, the word like, Letter niggas, Force. Niggas, niggas like niggas I created like, the word. Niggas like niggas like Forty Cal. Niggas like copyright. You know, niggas been doing that shit. Niggas been doing that shit. You know what I'm saying? So, like, for him to say the that word is actually for. sad. It's actually sad. But I created you know, the word I'm, little I'm, for actually. I'm, I'm, I'm doing this, this, this is, I'm doing this battle for a bigger purpose. Like, this, this battle with Big T, it has nothing to do with Big T. Nothing. Like, there's a bigger purpose with the battle. Okay. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and once he understands that and stops sleeping, like he has to, he has to understand that just because you don't see me battle, that shit don't mean nothing. That shit doesn't mean anything. Oh, uh, he must got, he must got the itis. That nigga sleeping. Uh <laughs> you know, Big T. You know, I don't know, man. T, T, yeah. You know, you know, you know. He jump, he jump in the line in front of callers and everything, man. Come on, y'all. This gotta stop eventually, y'all. Come on, man. He jumping the line in front of callers. He get his own segment on my show. You know, it's cool. Go ahead. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> so, for Mickey, you want to keep going? You know, Big T really does know a lot in real life, so you got to talk about I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm actually giving Big T some shine. You know what I'm saying? Like, he, he doesn't even understand that nobody cares. Nobody cares about Big T. When fans call in and say... I, I don't think you could beat Mickey Fax. I can't even quote a Mickey Fax bar. That must hurt your soul. That gotta hurt your soul. Wow. That has to hurt your soul. <laughs> that nigga sound like a bear. That nigga sound like the hyper baby. I've heard this piece before. before. He's, he's a deer. Like he's, he's a deer. Like they belong in the woods. This nigga is a he, this nigga sound like a bell. <laughs> he sound, he, he's a deal, like man. A, this he sound like he's a, a deal. He's a deal. He's a deal. He's a deal. He's a deal. Do you think, do you think, do you think, do you think I'm going to ask you since Mickey's on the phone right now. Do you think Mickey's on the phone is any threat to you? Mickey, do you think Mickey's on the phone is any threat to you? I don't know what you said. One, 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 one. I, I said, Big T, since Mickey's on the phone, do you think that Mickey Fax poses any threat to you? Well, man, no, nah, man. I'm just keep it real, man. No. No. Man, he got to probably do a couple backwards flips or some shit. You would call, he would call me a deer. That's venison. This nigga's hungry. You always got to, this nigga always got to talk about food and everything he do? That's crazy. I don't crazy. know. I mean, are we, are we but, but, but tons, of, tons, of, tons of love for my man Tabitha, though. He is going to feel, he's going to, huh. He doesn't even understand what's about to happen to him, and I feel bad now, for him cause he, now, because he's because he literally. Uh, Big T says 
And I should, I'm in Minnesota, I should, the way I speak about the Meek Mills and the Cassidy coming to the ring and these other people, that I should also reference you in that. Now, tell me why I shouldn't reference you in that and why Big T is, is wrong. No, I mean, I should be referenced like that. Then okay. it, makes, it, makes, it, makes, it, makes, it makes for a better story. It makes for a better mm-hmm. story. You know what I'm saying? So, 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 so. It makes for a wonderful story. I want, I want, see, it's, it's, it's like, a, it's like I'm torn. Like, I want him to sleep, but I also want him to take this extremely seriously. Like, you know what I'm saying? So, wow. Uh, but, you know, <laughs> he only takes food how, how, how long, how long, how long do we usually let callers talk before they go to the next one? I mean, you know, Mickey, like you said before, Mickey is special. He's he's part of the team, so we got to give him more leeway than you. I mean, I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> right, you, you know what? You right. You right, Mickey. Grab a seat, man. Grab a seat, Mickey. Who next? Go to that car. Grab a seat, Mickey. He's a, he's over the rest of the show. This is what he do anyway. This, this is oh. right. This boy. <laughs> all the time, man. See, what no, people no, fail to realize, Mickey, people fail to realize Mickey, why did you pick Big T of, 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 of for anybody? Because you got to understand something. Like, Big T is, is nice. I like Big T. Big T can rap extremely well. And I only want to take niggas that can rap extremely well. It was either going to be Rex, Lux, or Verb. And Rex and Lux, those are my brothers. We didn't run into it. We didn't run into and We didn't run into each other in the streets back in the days. And Verb... You know, he kind of falling off a little bit. But Big T, you know, he, he can actually rap. He can rap very well. You know what I'm saying? But he going he gonna, to he gonna, he gonna feel these punches hard. They're going to hit him very hard. Extremely mm-hmm. hard. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's going he, he gonna to get hurt. Big T, hey, Mickey. Mickey, Mickey can punch hey, yo, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. What's up, Tawana? <laughs> Nothing, man. What's up, Nothing, Tawana? Bro. What's up, Tawana? Enjoy it, man. Mickey, mm-hmm. do you think Mickey Fax can punch with you three rounds? I think Mickey Fax do drugs. What? What did you just say? Think you just burped up. I think, huh? do you think Mickey Fax can punch with you for three rounds? Three rounds? Oh, um, no. He could try. He could try. Hawaii punch? Hawaii punch? Oh, is that what he said? Yeah. Is this a fat joke? Typical fat jokes. You know. I bet this ain't my first battle, Mickey. This is yours. I remember your first battle. I remember when Lux showed it to me. Mm -hmm. You know, you were standing in front of a microphone. Remember that battle? Yeah. You know, you know, you know, but but what that showed is I paid my dues. You know, nigga, I paid. I think I paid my dues, nigga. I've been in the street. Yeah, yeah. I've been killing niggas. I've been killing niggas for a long time. I've been killing for a long time. Hey, hey, Mickey, 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 can I have a reference battle? Can I have a reference battle? At least I can watch a game tape or something. Nigga, 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 you tweeted, you do tweet. You want an NBA battle? My battle. Mickey, I thought you weren't talking to me, Mickey. I thought you weren't talking to me. You tweeted my battle to URL, nigga. What the fuck is you talking about? Now you want to you want to play stupid now. What battle are you now. talking about? Now you want to play stupid. 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 All right. I just want to. I just. I just need some reference battles. Some mo- well, my bad. I'm a bad. I'm not going out. Can I, can I get some modern material battles? Wow. It's all good. You gonna stand there? 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 You gonna stand you gonna stand there and make all these sports you references, football, and you man. can't even play sports. Like, how could you? Well, you want to play sports? You don't even. You can't even play sports. You make sports references. What the fuck is you, you talking about? You at least you get game tape of the other team. I have no game tape, no nothing. It's like, and then they talk about you nervous. How do I be nervous of something I never seen? This nigga crazy. I'm just being real. How, how do you be nervous of somebody you never seen? Do, oh, do yeah. nothing. I mean, and and that and that's that's what that's why you should be nervous, nigga, because you don't know what the fuck is gonna happen. Hey, Ooh, man, it's gonna be I, rough. I, it's I, gonna I, be I, rough. I, 
It's gonna be rough. Only, 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 ki only kids scared of ghosts, man. It's gonna be, it's gonna be rough, nigga. <laughs> it's gonna be real rough for you. That's all I'm no, saying. It's gonna be rough. It's gonna I, I, be rough. I've been, I've been, I've been in the ring with real killers, nigga, man. Nigga, 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 nigga. Please, <laughs> please. All right. You died against Hollow the Don. Died. Wow. You didn't lose. You died. You died. Let's not get crazy. You died. I wish, I wish, I wish I could say. I wish I, I wish I could I wish I wish I wish I could have seen the same for you, Nikki. I wish I, 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 I wish you could I wish you could too. And your battle with Chris uh, was whack. Your shit was whack. I don't know what the like against Surf you battle was great, but against Clips, but against Clips was I, I can't even I can't even say what it was. That's what that shit was. My battle with what with who? Oh God, here we go. No, I didn't even say it. I didn't even say it. And I thought you were falling the clips. I said with clips. I said clips. Oh, clips. Okay. Clips. Oh, my God. Clips. 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 Let's not go there, cause that, hey, that, that that's that's not my fault. Don't have that battle look. All right, hey, man. That's yeah, you know, you know, you know, you know, hey, listen. First of all, first of all, the faculty. I listen. I, I don't want to go there. Why the battle look like that, y'all? All right. Tell us how to tell us how to battle with Hollow was, nigga. He killed you, B. That's sad, B. He killed you. He really killed you. Mickey. He Mickey. killed you. Mickey. 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 I wish I could you. say the same for you, man. I he just wish you. I could. I wish I he could argue you. with you. I can't argue with you. I can't be like, you know what? He battled when you battled. Man. That's true. That's true. I'm going to have battle. one battle. I'm going to have one battle with you. Look at that. One battle. I'm headlining. Ain't that something? In front. This, and, it's gonna be be, and it's going to be. This, this, and it's this gonna be, this will be, be like my third or fourth one, man. This will be my third or fourth one. And it's gonna be in front of niggas that you ain't never see or meet before. How does that mm -hmm. make you feel? How does that make you feel? I always, you know always I battle. I always battle. I always battle in front of people I've never seen or meet before, hey, hey, bro. Hey, you, you know I got two shows before I battle, right? Cause that's what that's what I do. Hey man, listen, so this is, this you should have got three. Yeah, good, good, good. Look, you should have got th you should have got three shows and left the battle out. This is gonna hurt. This, this is gonna hurt. You should, instead of having two shows before you battle me, you should have took on three shows and left the battle out. Well, I'm glad you're taking hey, more battles you this year because you usually battle once a year. But I'm I'm very happy. Hey, hey, hey I, ba I battle Deacon Frost in one month. I battle Hitman the next month. Then I battle Hollow in the third month. Damn! Then don't take three battles at a time. You see what happens with you? I did. I did. I did a month after month. Every, now, 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 look. Battles for three, they three, four months now. I battle month after month after month. I did. So I did. Yo, that was my rookie. Yeah. That was your rookie mistake, right? Uh, you, I did, uh, I did, I did that, I did that. I, I made my rookie mistakes. Now you, you got to make your rookie mistakes against a seasoned vet like me. Ah oh, man. You know, this, yeah, this battle is... Uh, Michael, get some callers and ask some questions right now. So we get some callers. I didn't interrupt his show, but it's cool, man. Grab, grab, grab a seat, man. Grab a seat, man. Grab a seat. You don't understand. You don't understand marketing, nigga. That's why you still... With grab, grab a seat, right Mickey. Grab a seat. Oh, Mickey, what you don't understand, I understand it very well. Just grab a seat, man. Come, you know what I'm saying? Get you something to drink. Pull up a chair. Why well, you always got to make that call? I want to talk like three. <sighs> Let's go to a call. Let's go, uh, 561, you there? Yo, what's poppin', y'all? What's good night, man? What's poppin'? What's good? Yo, uh, first of all, Big T, what's poppin', my nigga? What's good, bro? Mickey, facts, my dude. Real talk, though. I understand you battle back in the 90s, my nigga. <sighs> Late 2000s? Well, my nigga, we never hey. seen you battle. So for you to come on the show and act like we never seen you battle, there's no footage of you, my nigga. There's, there's no footage. There's, 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 there's Let's be real here. Let's be real here. 
The Loaded That's Lux, the Murder Mooks, all these niggas that been in battles, they've been watching niggas. That's what they've been doing. Let's not be fooled. They've been watching you niggas. So, Mickey, I don't know where you come with that. Now, to the call that called in, now let's be real. Mickey, I'm not shocking you because you're on the show, my nigga. I think Hollow yeah. beat you. I think you beat DNA. Uh-huh. I think you, that second round against Charlie Cooks is me, my nigga. That's that call of shit, that big L shit that could have made you wear the Louis and all that shit. That shit was hard. Now, Thank you, you beat Surf 2. You beat Surf 2. <laughs> and, and Jesse, you out there, my nigga? Jesse, you yeah. Jesse. Anyway, yeah, yeah, I'm here, Jesse. I'm here, I'm here. Yeah, hey, I want to holler at you, my nigga. You had the nerve to say that Sue Surf beat Con 3 to 0? Yeah, I mean, that's my opinion. That is absurd. I'm, I ain't no disrespect to niggas, because I know niggas love Surf on Twitter. They get all fucking crazy. They act like this nigga's the, the best battle rapper to ever do it. And, my, and I ain't dissing Surf. He gets it in, but to me, he didn't really beat nobody like a three. He had no body back under his belt. He didn't even beat the nigga yeah. on the show tonight. Hold on, hold on. you got to understand. you got to ask Jesse why and why did Surf get him thrilled? And then I told you, Surf, you, Surf talked to him. You know the same why reason why. Talk to him? Him? You know, it's the same reason uh, I give Big T, Big T versus DNA. Big T talked to him. My nigga, my nigga, well, he talked to me one round. He talked to me one round. First of all, I'm not a nigga that dick rides the crowd and all that shit because I think that's overrated. But the crowd to me was feeling uh, punches and shit. The first round. I didn't hear that ag- aggressive Sue Surf in the first round. Let's go round one. Round one. The, the, the first the round is when he did the church line. And the first round is also when he said the, the um, shoot, the Brooklyn shoot, got the, the nest shoot, is so shoot, good. Nigga, the best shooters are still in my hood, nigga. That's one the first line, round. Nigga, one line, which Kyle was saying, no punches, 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 punches. Second round, I give you that. Surf was talking to that nigga. He was talking to that nigga, Khan. That Red Lobster shit, that Khan Hank shit, that Brooklyn shit, that pri- all that shit, he was spitting to that nigga. And the third round... Your boy, he sucks. <laughs> His minute stopped. I, 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 I don't understand that. But anyway, though, man, let's stop acting like Mickey Fat is going to come in and you know, wreck shop. Cause we have no footage of the nigga. I don't care what you did in Harlem with a Bronx. That's what's up. That's what's up. That's what's up, That's brother. what the that's fuck you doing up. now, my nigga. And I'm telling that's you, all these battle rap that's niggas, Lord and Lux, Wookie, all up. these niggas, they just study niggas to that's see what niggas up. doing, and then now they want to call niggas out. Well, Mickey, that's Puff Daddy up, and them niggas, they're going to help you out, man. That's Big T, up. eat that nigga, my nigga, Jesse. That's what's up. up. That's what's that's up. up. That's my nigga, I got you. I'm going to need all of it. He's going to need all this support. He's going to need it all, baby. Thank you, brother. Appreciate you. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Shit. <laughs> Mickey still here? Yeah, I'm still here, fat boy. All right, all right, all right, y'all. Let's talk to the next caller. Thank you. Damn. 812, <laughs> you there? Yeah, yeah. Yo, yeah. man. Yo, Big T, why are you battling this Charles Hammond and Wanna Be, man? This dude ain't. Come on, man. Y'all messing up the game, man. Y'all got proven battle <laughs> shit, and this dude going to. Damn. Come on, man. Y'all messing the game up. Stop having Mickey Fax and all these cats. Man, let them cats battle Shadow Boy or whoever the fuck these new dudes is, man. This is crazy, Thank man. You, bro. It, it's a shame that people have to go through their battle leagues, go through their three, four proven grounds with Norbs, then yeah. get on the main stage, then get in some other battles and battle me. But Mickey Fax, a guy with no footage, could just be like, hey, I want the team. Right, right. Thanks, One man. more thing, man. Thanks, bro. Thanks. Thanks. Man, stop saying the hollow beat you, man. Because I, I don't see it. No, man. no, no, no. Look, look, look. I'm going to rush it in. I'm going to get that boy. I'm I'm, I'm with it. I'm with it, bro. No, I'm just talking about you. I feel like hollow, hollow, hollow got round three. Hollow, hollow, I feel hollow, like hollow. one and two was even. But round three, <laughs> I feel like he ended the battle better than me. And that's my fault on what I did. It was my rookie mistakes. You feel me? That yeah, I'm mean, saying, I'm saying like, like, when he come up with that, Joe, so I mean, come on, that's elementary shit, like, you know what I mean? Hello, like, body him. He's body him. Oh, Mickey, hey, they're going to they make you sex chiming in on somebody else's body, on somebody else's battle. Go ahead, Mickey, back. Somebody else's body. Somebody else's body. That's what I'm saying, like, Midwest cats are killing stuff, and they just got to take, in the average New York can't pump them up like 
hollow the door and calling out Lux, and Lux is over high too. Like, that normal Thank house world you. bait shit, Thank man. You. That shit. Do you ask somebody to break down loaded Lux's rounds? They can't tell you what he's talking about. But everybody acting like that loaded Lux battle was just, oh my God. Man, come on, man. This shit Thank crazy. you, bro. Thank that you. shit is crazy. Y'all need to stop that shit, man. Loaded Lux ain't, ain't proving nothing to me, man. He choked. And everybody act like he killed Calico, man. Come on, man. Big T, do your thing, man. For real, man. Hey, Ain't nobody so new for that. Hello, on, big brother. Hey, and you see, and you see, and you see what the black two callers called in from the other two callers. They called in with facts. They called in for facts about facts. Oh, isn't that sweet? They did. They called in with, um, this, this, this. They called in telling you about footage of mine. There's nothing they could say about you. Nothing. I got, got, got there's nothing to talk about. <sighs> All right, Nikki Facts, you know what? You still here? Go ahead and take a seat. Get yourself a drink. Let's talk to the next caller, y'all. Uh, you know what? You know what? Since Mickey Fax thinks he could jump in the ring and do my job, I'm doing his job on the show. Next caller, y'all. <laughs> oh, oh boy! Four one zero, yeah. Four one zero, yeah. Four, one, zero, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. See, yeah. Since you yeah. want to take my job, I want I want to take his job. What button I press to talk to the next caller? <laughs> What's good, yeah, four one zero? Yeah, oh, I'm just saying. Um, big. I think I got Big T winning for real. You know. Hope you do your thing, but Mickey, I just want to say, Mickey, you know, you like analysts to this uh, battle that you give your opinions and everything, so you can't, you got to show up. If you don't oh, show yeah. up, you, you know, it's all kind of look bad never. for you, because you I'm always gonna, give I'm your... Gonna, I'm going to show out. I'm going to show out. I'm going right. to show out. It's going to be bad. <laughs> it's going to be bad. It's going to be so bad. Well, uh, oh, well. Yeah, I was just saying, yeah, you got to do your thing because, you know, you give your... You, you call him an analyst? Did you oh, call him an analyst? No, I say that because, you know, he... I'm about to call him an analyst? Come on, man. No, nah, yeah. I'm saying. Listen, listen, this is why I say this. I say that because, you know, everybody... Mickey kind of told when he judged the... He always judged the battles. You know, people <laughs> take his opinion. Yeah. So you feel me? That's why I say he's kind of a he's kind of a analyst because people listen to what he has to say on the battle. Right, he just, right. Uh, clip. Right, you, you know, y'all know what I'm trying to say. So yeah, yeah, I know. You know? I'm, just, I'm just bullshitting with Mickey, man. You know what I'm saying, Mickey? You got a seat over there? You know, take a seat, Mickey. Grab you something to drink. Uh, you know, yeah, we having a good time, Terrence. We just having a good time, man. You know, we having a great time, brother. Great time. You know, you know, like you say, he's an analysis. He's the guy that um, when analysis, the battles go down, analysis, and throwing man, he's one one oh one gill, one oh um. Oh my God! Did you hear that last line, young Gill said? He tweets it. This is young people. Oh my God! One one J C Young Gill. Oh man! Analysis. This battle is classic. I'm an, I'm an analysis. I'm an analysis apparently. Oh boy, this is gonna be rough for you, T. This is gonna be cool. Let's go. Seven. Oh, man, you, like, hold on, Mick. You want your job back now? Uh, uh, <laughs> this is this was never my job, brother. Man, sorry. Five seven. You. Let's go another call. Let's go. Five one six. You there? Yo, what up? What up? What up? Yeah. Yo, keep it real. I'm I'm going with Mickey Facts all the way. Mm-hmm. I I five one six in New York area code. Uh, okay. Yeah, cool. but you also, you also gotta you also gotta look at the dudes that called before me. He was seven one eight, and that's closer to Mickey than I am. So you can't even Clearly. say something about me. Clearly, you're wilding. You beat you beat surf. You be I just surf and you beat DNA. Other than that, all the heavy hitters did not did not beat. Like, right. I think, I think I think you you nice, but it's a difference with being nice and being nice with intelligence. If you look at how Nick Pack and, and Lux and Luke talk, if you look at like 
they spit exactly how they talk, and they mad. At, if you listen to their bars, they mad intelligent with it, and your street talk is not gonna work on them. They're too smart for it. Yo, he doesn't. He doesn't understand. So, so, so hold on, hold on. Are you mentioning Mickey Fox in that same era with like Mookie Lux? As far as battling, if, have you? No, no, no. I'm talking about ha, lyrics. Battling is you can rap. You can put a verse that you spit on and turn it into a battle verse. It's, to me, that's how I see it. Like, and how y'all do you battle? About how, do you battle? Do you battle? Do I battle? No. No, no not professionally. Fan. Not professionally, but I mean, like, do you battle? Like, have you ever, like, really, like, battle somebody? As, as far ever. as rapping, no. So you don't know. It's not, it's not like that. It's not. All battling is is street poetry. I keep telling niggas. All battling, battling is is, is battling. It's aggressive spoken word. That's all it is. That's all it is. Aggressive spoken word. Street poetry. That's it. That's it. So now, no, so now I'm about to go I'm about to go into the street poetry rap with Mickey Fox. You acting like this is chemistry, B. I'm going to the street poetry. Battling is the easiest thing to do, B. That shit is not <laughs> oh, 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 yeah. It's not yeah, you're right. <laughs> this shit is not you're the right. hardest shit in the world. It's not. You're right. It's not. This shit is easy. Niggas been doing this shit, B. This shit is light. This shit is light. Oh, that shit, that shit do look, that shit do look easy when you're watching it. Yawn. It looks very easy when you're watching it. Oh, All right, you know what, matter of fact, Nicky Sacks, take a seat. You know what I'm saying? I see, I see you still there. Let's go to the next caller, man. <laughs> uh, 732, you there? Yo, yeah, what up? Psycho, when you get a chance, get us, go to 718 number. That's uh, Black Jesus, if you can. All right. 732, you there? Yeah, what up? You hear me? Yeah, what up? <sighs> Yo, what's good? Um... Yo, just real quick to touch on something Mickey said. Like, I don't, I'm not going for nobody because I'm not a fan of no battle rap. I just like good battles. Big T, you? like, you nice. Right out. Like, you nice. Hey, Mickey, you nice too. But, like, Mickey said, battle rapping is easy because a battle rapper could body everybody he battles. But when it comes time to, like, make a song, make a track, they could take 20 years out of their life and never be able to make a good song. So, Mm-hmm. If, if it's just something where, all right, Mickey got to get back into the, the flow of things, this ain't going to be a one-round battle. Like, it's going to be a three-round battle. And you'll know, so with Lux. Lux first round, okay, yeah, he choked. He had to get the feel. He had to get the feel, just like he said. After he got the feel, it was over. The cat was over, flat out. So with Mickey, I'm, now I'm not saying Mickey going to win, but I wouldn't sleep on Mickey because he ain't done it in a while. Like, forget that. To get all that, because it's battling. It's like riding a bike. You know what I'm saying? And and T now I think the advantage is T. He's a rapper where personals don't really affect them. Because like, yo, you fat, I right, fat joke, whatever. To be T, which is why I think he be Surf and I think he be DNA, but he couldn't be Hollow because Hollow don't need to rely on personals. And if Hollow's gonna hit you with personals, he's gonna make it so that. They funny, the crowd feel them, and they're not going to be cliché. Like rappers like Surf, okay, his aggression. How are you going to be aggressive with Big T? Like Big T don't claim to be this thug where you got to kind of compromise his gangster. DNA, DNA spit. I mean, I don't know what, what, the, what the big talk about DNA is, but whatever DNA was doing wasn't working with T. Mickey, I think Mickey could, even if he got a game plan going and he see it on working, he got enough experience to be able to switch it up. And I think, T, you could do the same thing. So, again, I don't know who's going to win. I just know it's going to be a good battle. It's not going to be, no, T, you're not going to 3-0 Mickey. Like, you just not. And, Mickey, I, don't, I can't say you're going to 3-0 T because T is I, nice. I, I'm but. not, not going to 3-0 him. I don't want to 3-0 him. I want it to be a debatable classic. That's all I want. Yeah, and, that's all and that's, I want. That's, that's what I know it's going to be because, yo, if you nice, you nice. And if you look at Battle Rap now, the only way to get 3-0, like, body is if you trash. You choke. And nobody and you trash. choke or you trash. Right. Exactly. 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 And, and, oh, and real quick. He don't understand that. 
he he don't. But but I, I feel I feel the way he 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 talking, yo. Because there's a lot of it's, yo. You gotta brag. You gotta talk your shit. I feel that. And real quick for Noah, I had I had uh I had QB Jazz versus QB battle. You know I know you was talking about that last week. I definitely had QB in that. Really? Okay. Yeah, I had QB. I had yo. The reason why I had QB is because Jazz. The the best thing about Jazz, her delivery and the way she could tell the crowd to chill. Okay, that's her her best thing, and she cute. QB, QB just spits like yo. She's she's just hot. And and another thing with real. And my last point, the whole thing with like the crowd. I don't understand. Because, I, like I said, I'm not, like, a fan of any individual battle rap. I just love the battle. But the crowd, I just don't get how the reactions be the reactions, like, especially in New York, because I I grew up, like, listening to, you know, Rakim, KRS, Kane, all the way up to Biggie. So if I hear Biggie verse, who I think is the best rapper ever, I'm not listening. I've never listened to one of his verses and, and screamed at the top of my lungs and went crazy. So it's like, yo, how could cats hear something jazz say or surf say, a con say, and then just start losing their mind? It's like, yo, what do y'all normally listen to? Like, y'all must listen to Drake on the radio or, or Waka Flocka to think, what do you do no, with the same and have you do backflips? You're just saying that surf didn't say nothing crazy because she didn't say nothing crazy and jazz didn't say nothing crazy. Like QB was spitting? Is that what you just said? No, 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 no. no. Jazz, Jazz definitely, definitely was saying some hot stuff. I just like what QB was saying over what Jazz was saying. Like, first and second round, I think QB got that. Third round, Jazz killed it. Like, Jazz, Jazz actually, it could be debated that if you don't even look at it like, okay, I got to go round by round by round, Jazz third round probably could have won the whole battle. But since a lot okay, of my, my point is, what, what's your point about the crowd? I, I'm people are going crazy. It doesn't. I, I'm, I'm not following you right now. My whole point is that a lot of stuff she was saying. If you just listen to it, just listening to what she was saying, it was like regular bars. But the crowd. Okay, how they so you were, so you were impressed. Hold on. So you went crazy when when Shubi said that she hit the broke like a hit the burner inside of her vagina. That was crazy to you. No, 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 not at all. I'm, saying, I'm, like, I'm, just, you, I'm, just, if, I'm just kind of blown away. But here's here's, here's my thing. Though, I'll, I'll be quick. I'll be real quick. Along. The way that the way that you watch the battle, if somebody says a bar and then the crowd goes crazy to cause that that rapper to stop, even if you're not really feeling that bar, just that whole reaction, that whole vibe in the room is going to make that bar hit harder than it actually did. So Jazz had a lot more of that than QB had. Okay, but you also like said that about Surf and Cedar. I'm not talking about Jazz. I can like, I, I'm still trying to find your point. People Surf said a lot of hot shit. So did Cedar. Sometimes people overhype bars, but if they feel it's hot in the building, it's hot. Like, uh, I, I'm still not following it. You know, oh, what, yeah, what no, 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 no doubt. No doubt. If they think it's hot, then it's going to be hot. But that could always be, like, expanded based off of the crowd reaction. Like, no matter what, because there's, and I'm, I'm sure, because you, especially you, you're front row. I'm sure you've heard, of, like, a lot of balls. You're like, all right, that was average. But after you look back on Cam, if you see that the crowd got to the point where the, the rapper had to stop, that ball could be taken way, way further than what it was. Okay, now what's your question for Mickey or Big T? No, nah, I just wanted to put a statement right. overall. Um, like I said, y'all do your thing, all of y'all. Love the show, Big T. You're nice. No matter what these callers say, you're well, nice. Mickey, you've been nice, and I know you're going to put on a great battle. Appreciate right. that, bro. Appreciate it. Thanks for the call. All right, let's... Uh... Tell me what they like you. I, I don't know. I, I got lost. I wasn't sure what he was trying to say at, at, at the point. I'm, I'm kind of lost, but... but he was saying that. how the people... Yeah. He was just saying yeah. how people going to react. Yeah, hey, hear me? Yeah. Hello? Yeah, hello? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. First, hey, uh, first of all, I say thanks, Norris, for chiming me in because I don't think I don't think Psycho likes uh, seven one eight numbers, man. For some reason, he doesn't chime us in, man. It's crazy. <laughs> We're all New Yorkers. And uh, that last caller, he put me to sleep, man. I'm driving home. I'm always in New York. I mean, I'm a military guy. I travel back and forth, and that nigga put me to sleep. So, and uh, 
you know, and no, again, thanks for clarifying on Twitter because I didn't know, I didn't realize female rappers don't, you know, have that much of a attention span as far as the fans. And I said the little thing about they don't have jazz, QB doesn't have the replay value. But, you know, it makes sense now what you said. And, yeah, oh, yeah, back to, yeah that's crazy. Battles, yeah. Right, I, I looked at the numbers and it makes sense, you know. But, yeah, but to Big T, um, I'm sorry, man, but honestly, my opinion, I, I think you have to go back to the PGs. Not for your lyrical, it's for your marketing value, because you, you're not a marketable guy, man. Like, I don't think a person can just watch you bear to just watch you for a longer than they have to. And it's something, I don't know, it's something about the way you carry yourself. You know, I, I think the battle between you and uh, Mickey is going to go, you know, Mickey's going to come out, he's going to look, you know, he's going to be swagged out, he's going to be clean. You're going to come rushing to the stage with probably like ketchup stains <laughs> on your lips and mustard on your shirt. And you're going to, you know, you're going to lose. You're going to lose round one. You're going to lose round one. No, no, no. You're going to lose round one because you're going to have food stains on your shirt, dude. This dude, this dude. No. No, no, no. That was a long time. Round two. Let me tell you how it's going to go out. Round two, you're going to lose because your eyes are going to be all over the place. you got the Rick Ross sleepy eye and the sweat, the sweat on your neck, that black sweat on your neck is going to be dripping been off of your shirt, and people are going to be like, what the fuck, you're going to have to mop up the floor, because you're going to be sweating all that dirt on your neck, and round three, round three, you're going to lose, no, 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 you know what I'm saying? Man, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, bro, hold on, hold on. You was a fucking madman with a tight ass shirt and a small book bag, man. You got a small book bag and a tight shirt. Finish the show, man. Nah, man, how you in summer madness with a small hat and a baby book bag on? You got a small book bag and a tight shirt. Nah, man, you in summer madness with a small hat and a baby book bag on? Hold on, cut, cut him off right quick. It, it's seven one eight eight two zero. That's Black Jesus. He's trying to get to. That's not the seven one eight we wanted to come on. Hold on, hold on. Before we get, before we get to, to Black Jesus, that too was hilarious. I'm sorry. Yo, that was rude, B. Come on, man. I don't see no other seven. Lyrics, not appearance. You know what I'm saying? Lyrics, not appearance. We all know he's dirty. Big T, you got to admit that was funny. I, that was hilarious. I'm not going to lie. Big T, you there? <laughs> Come on, no. This is psycho, man. He's going to be mad at me after the year, baby. It wasn't me. He was the first 718. That's only 718 I saw. Yeah. Take a one right here. 718, you there? <laughs> yo, yo. yo. Uh, hold on, hold on, Black T. This, oh, nigga, this, this nigga yeah, basically but, hung up because psycho, man. <laughs> this nigga was going on him. I'm not going to lie. No, I'm not eating that one. No, I'm not eating that one. You said get 718 in here. That was 718. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what they all talk about. I like that one. Yo, <laughs> that, that nigga that one. big piece soul up in the sky, baby. <laughs> Psycho, say I, I. Nobody else saying I. You guys stuck. Psycho controls the board. <laughs> you do a few ones that say 718 in here. You say 718 in That's you what know, I got. Did he really hung up? Because I think he's really mad at us right now. Wow. It was just, he's really upset at us, man. I don't know who that 718 caller was, but he's hilarious. He needs to come on the show more often. I don't know who the fuck that was. But anyways, we got Black Jesus on. Black Jesus, where you at? Yo, yo, I'm here, I'm here. All right, uh, wait, so what do you guys want? Do you want to cut the show off, or do you want to? No, we, so we got Black Jesus on. 
What's the matter with you? Go to Black Jesus. Yeah, that was hilarious. Nikki, was that not the funniest fucking call ever? Nikki hung up. Oh, my God. That was the funniest call ever. Black Jesus. What's up? That's crazy, man. I've been dying to jump in there, man. I want to... I had to say something to both of them real quick. One of the dudes had it right on the head. He called he called Mickey um autistic. He was trying to be nice about it, but he was saying Mickey has that autistic feel to him, like Lux and shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I feel that's what I feel Big T don't notice that yet either. Mickey got a video out called um Photos of Naked Chicks or some shit like that where he looked like um Hancock. Yeah. The boy's talented, man. You know what I mean? I don't know if he's Battling is one thing, because, you know what I mean, Big T is Big T. It's top, I feel he's still top tier, even with the losses, you know what I mean, people want to throw at him. But Mickey's been standing, like he said, on the sideline of scouting for a very long time, and he's talented. The boy the boy ain't no retard, man. He's going gonna to put something together. You know what I mean? Also, real quick, Psycho, man, shout out to you and them Redskins, man. All right, that's what's up. You already know. Anyway, can't even front. I, 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 you know what I mean? I'm not a fan of nothing but RG3 just doing his motherfucking thing. You know what I mean? So you got, I got to show you love. You've been riding with them all year. Every time I listen to the show, I hear you showing them love, and I know. You know what I mean? My nigga knows a little tight. You know what I mean? Got some giant blue balls. Pause. You know what I mean? You no know, playoffs. I mean, I mean, when you win two Super Bowls and, and, and four, five you, sometimes years, you need rest, And you right? haven't won, you and take you a haven't break, won since I was in fucking sixth grade, which are the Redskins. <laughs> I mean... You know, it's all good. I'm not mad. I'm content where I'm at. But have that caller, that last caller, happens to be the funniest nigga ever. He I'm mad he called out Big T on his book bag at Summer Madness, though. He didn't have to get well, out his book bag. What did he say about Big T's book bag? He nigga say he had on a little mini book bag on his back. Nigga <laughs> <laughs> said his book had the mini joint. Bro, but why did Big T hold up? He was really mad like that. You know I'm gonna hear it. You know he's gonna call me like no, I was like to cut him off, and I'm gonna throw it on Psycho. The Psycho is the one. That Bro, don't me, don't not throw me. I'm, yo, Nobs though, y'all gonna have to do something about that. Y'all do look shaky with that one move though. You know what I mean, Mickey? Big P gonna ride that one. Mickey be his staff and all. You know what I'm saying? He's, that, that, that's gonna be his reason. If, he, if he's talented yeah, like funny. Verb, if he's talented like Verb, that'll be the reason if he loses. I tell you that. No, dude, I, that was that was one of the funniest calls in, in the history of of, of calls, man. Right? I'm not gonna lie, to that. whoever that caller was, please tweet me. You are one funny son of a bitch. And then and, and then the other guy, I don't know what the fuck he was talking about. The one before him, he talked about we never we didn't talk about the QB jazz though. He said he tagged QB one and fine, and then he starts talking about surfing. He, I was lost. Can anybody clarify what he was talking about? Apparently not. No. I, I was wondering, dude, what the fuck is your question? But shout out to him. He probably just edged, uh, he probably just worded it wrong. But um, I guess we're gonna end the show now because Big T matters. Uh, I don't you know, know what the hell just happened right there. I mean, Big T, uh, it was like a talk. I didn't, I, I don't know why he didn't call up the caller, but I'm not gonna lie, he was really funny to call up. So. I mean, yeah. I, know, I mean, what do you guys think? I think it's all your fault, Norris. <laughs> Jesse, what do you think? Hey, Jesse's over here getting drunk. I, I, I don't. I, I, I didn't like the, the fact that I was really trying to get Black Jesus on. I wasn't trying to get. Down. Well, so was I. I, I thought something yeah, well, happened. I, well, yeah. So was I. Uh, we. <laughs> I, yeah, I, no. uh, what they? I don't. I, I mean, I, I feel talking. like he feels a certain way just because talking it's like not because of the quality. Nobody said it wasn't Black Jesus. I thought it was him. Nobody <laughs> said nothing. I thought it was him. <laughs> Bro, I heard the nigga talking, and the nigga was mad funny, so I was like, yo, this nigga's hilarious. The nigga said that big T got that food stays on his shirt, bro. That's hilarious. I didn't even just say that out of nowhere. But, um, I don't know, man. Big T took that personal. But, uh, Big T, you know you want me to That wasn't on purpose. I don't know what that was. Yeah, if anybody gets the blame, it's got to go to Psycho because, you know, Psycho, he <laughs> <laughs> chose it. It was dogs, bro. Yeah. Psycho, man, take it out of here, man. I'm, I, I got to call Big T, he's mad at me. Yeah. 
URL's Battle Rap Arena. Check us out Thursday, 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. We out. Smirat! Smirat!